The need for kidney donors is so crucial for so many people waiting for an organ, and a Camden County detective knows that reality all too well. Here's our Allie Reed. Detective Sean Miller has been with the Camden County Police Department for more than 24 years. He's widely known for the work he's done in the town that he grew up in, but now he's looking for the community to help him. I've helped people in my life, and it's hard for me to ask for help, but um, I'm asking people to help me. Camden County Detective Sean Miller is suffering from stage four kidney disease. It's a position he'd never imagined he'd be in, and now one that's gotten progressively worse. When you have the stress of the job, trying to solve a case, trying to be everything for everyone, um, it caught up with me. Sean can be described in many ways, a father, a husband to his wife, Michelle, a friend, and a cop. Being a police officer in the city of Camden, I wore it as a badge of honor because I can I'm, I'm back home. He started in patrol, transitioning to the narcotics unit. From there, he did general investigations and then was a homicide detective for seven years. He's that guy. He's that guy. There's plenty of times when I, I would come in here and I would be, I feel my best. <laughs> be there for me. Hinson would eventually become Miller's field training officer. Our particular squad was so tight. That's how we were, all 24 of us. It was September of 2021 when Miller began to feel winded doing everyday tasks. He listened to his body and went to his doctor later to find out his kidneys were failing. His nephrologist suggesting to consider a donor. Are you waiting for that moment? Oh, girl, what? <laughs> <laughs> um, is the excitement of the anticipation when I became a father and now It'll be the excitement and anticipation of me being here a little longer. Detective Miller will be on FMLA for the next nine months. Meantime, he's hoping more people will take the time to learn about kidney donation and how saving someone's life could potentially save yours too. If you're not a match for me, you can be a match for someone else. But also, if you have some underlying medical issues that you never knew about, you're finding out about what's going on with you. Again, the average wait time for a kidney is anywhere from five to seven years. So Detective Miller's best option is to find a living donor. He's hoping by getting his message out that more people would be willing to see if they're a match. We're in Camden, Allie Reed, Fox 29 News.